New York Governor Andrew Cuomo is going to be donating half a million dollars connected to the Buffalo Billion Trial. Andrew this Andrew money Cuomo. being donated to charity, it comes from campaign contributions made by people who have been convicted or pleaded guilty in the corruption case. That money will help with immigrant legal defense, Puerto Rican hurricane relief, and also women's health rights here in New York. Meantime, New York gubernatorial candidate Mark Molinaro is now calling for a federal investigation into Governor Cuomo. Molinaro claims that Cuomo is violating the law by having Excelsior Scholarship students appear in his re-election campaign ads. We get the story tonight from 7 Eyewitness News reporter Justin Moore. New York gubernatorial candidate Mark Molinaro is crying foul. And it's creepy. It's coercive. Molinaro, a Republican, is accusing Governor Andrew Cuomo of breaking federal law. He says the governor violated education privacy laws by using students who are receiving Excelsior scholarships to take part in his re-election ads. You can't help but feel slightly intimidated. The Federal Family Educational Rights and Privacy Act generally protects the privacy of college students' records. And Molinero says somehow the governor's campaign got its hands on those records. And we want the governor to answer those questions. Who knew what when? Who was influenced? Who, who, was made, who, who, who made what phone calls to whom? Uh, and, uh, and why were these kids, uh, why was their private information uh, uh, accessible by the... Yeah, by the, campaign. the Cuomo campaign says Molinero is playing political games and it did nothing wrong. We requested any publicly available list of state of the state invitees. The campaign says in a statement, it is clear Trump mini me Molinero will do anything to distract from his failing campaign. At least one student has come forward to say he felt violated by a phone call he received from the Cuomo campaign. Molinero is now asking the U.S. attorney to investigate the governor. Justin Moore, 7 Eyewitness News. And the latest Quinnipiac poll showing the governor holding a commanding 36-point lead in the upcoming Democratic primary for governor over Cynthia Nixon. The numbers, 59% to 23%.